at Matthew Perry's funeral, an emotional Peter Gabriel song brought his co-stars and family to tears. The final note of an emotional Peter Gabriel song, which has long inspired those battling addiction, was played at Matthew Perry's funeral, which his friend's co-stars attended, leaving his family and friends in tears. In black suits, Jennifer Aniston, Lisa Kudrow, Kurt Annie Cox, David Schwimmer, and Matt LeBlanc appeared solemn as they readied themselves for a private ceremony at Los Angeles Forest Lawn Cemetery to bid farewell to Perry. The song Don't Give Up by Peter Gabriel, which goes, No fight left or so it seems, I am a man whose dreams have all deserted. I've changed my face, I've changed my name, but no one wants you when you lose, was played as the funeral was coming to an end. Perry, 54, was discovered dead in a hot tub at his Los Angeles home last Saturday. Perry was candid about his lifelong struggle with alcohol and drug addiction. He had been clean and doing well, according to those close to him, just before he passed away. Along with his father John Perry, 82, his tearful mother Susan Morrison, 84, and stepfather Keith, a journalist for Dateline, were present at the private event. One person carrying the coffin was Keith Morrison. Although the cause of Perry's death is still unknown, preliminary toxicology tests reveal no fentanyl or meth in his system. By the end of the song, a bystander at the service reported that there was not a dry eye. Not a dry eye was in there, they declared. Both laughter and tears were abundant. Only close friends and relatives conversed. Sadly, the song also has the following lyrics, Don't give up because you have friends, keep going, you're not alone, don't give up, there's no reason to feel ashamed, keep going, you still have us. The British singer Kate Bush is featured on the song, which was written by Gabriel, the former lead singer of Genesis. Written during Margaret Thatcher's premiership in the 1980s, it was released as a single in 1986, shortly after the miners' strike of 1984-5. Gabriel claimed that Dolly Parton, a singer from the U.S., declined his initial approach. He told The Quietus in 2011 that I'm glad she did because what Kate did on it is brilliant. 2014 saw Sir Elton John say that the song saved my life and assisted him in his sobriety journey.